The, the paper feed starts with aligning this roll so that the fold will occur properly and aligning the folding mechanisms so that the fold will occur properly. And um, this uh, device here um, holds the roll in its alignment position and it also provides some weight to the roll so it provides drag on the roll. And the drag is important on the roll because it forces the, the paper to fold as it's being pulled through. It's, um, if you were to take uh, two ends, of, if, if two people were holding a piece of paper and it was loose and one person was to try and fold it, um, it would only fold locally. But if the two people held the paper tight and one person tried to fold one end, then the rest would follow. And that's the purpose of the, the weight of this drag shoe on this roll. Maybe it's slipping on the joint on that side. I have to take a closer look with uh, some light. But, but yeah, I'm correct. I have, to, I have to make this connection rigid, even though it's lousy for such a wide, you know, a lousy uh, half inch bar or seven sixteenths inch bar for such a wide span. Uh, but I'll have to make that rigid. And then this counter, uh, counterweight will have some effect on that side. Right. And then we adjust this uh, to it to, to be light enough. And I see because these are these are forked, that allows for this to be tilted and you can you can adjust the shoe um, so that it rides evenly. So that that's where this is. Okay. What do you suppose this tray was? Right. Oh man, look at that. Another yeah. glue another glue tray? I'm, I'm wondering if this isn't the wheel to apply the glue to I'll the bet it is. There you go. This goes in the middle, right here. <laughs> and that's where they're going. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. It goes on the edge because it's, it's the edge that's going to be glued. It's the edge that's going to be glued. Right, right, right. I think, right. I, so I think this is the glue applicator for the right. finishing the... Right. That's it. <laughs> that's it. So well this is done. The, so this is the center seam and the glue seam for the edge is on the other side. Well done. That's it. Son of a gun. Oh. There, now it's shifting. What's shifting? Papers. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, then, so really, uh, I, there must be some method that we don't know about for, for doing this. Yeah, so you see how hard that is to pull. So, the, so we can just take our weight and hang it on here. So in order to keep this shoe from applying too much pressure to the roll, what we've done is we've enforced the counterweight, this dingy little thing, with some less dingy weight. <laughs> it's rudimentary. I definitely need some more slack. But uh, yeah, maybe it'll do for now. Me, uh, these shoes need to be moved in. That's what it is. They need to be moved there. And here. Without cutting that. Close enough without cutting that. Okay, the thing is that we're trying to get it to fold on top of each other. If these are down in the valley, oh yeah, they could, that's right, they could, yeah, they could be down here. As long as they get it, see if they go down in the valley, they pull it open. Mm. So we need, we, need, we need them to be up here so that they, uh, they come together. But there's got to be some placement here. Some way of moving the rollers yeah. individually instead of and them. I think these these should just slide. You have to undo these both. Yeah. Uh, all undo right, these. I'll take that. I'll accept that. Either this has to go, this really wants to go way back there. Oh, I see it. Well, yeah, and then in. Uh, oh, all right. So that that's almost it. Except these want to be 
these want to be set so that they roll. So they definitely roll on the top. I think uh, this was a, a real piece at a time challenge. You couldn't just look at the machine and understand it all uh, until you started rotating it by hand. And then it was a process of following the individual uh, mechanisms. Um, and that's what this uh, road has, map has been.